Saturday. It's out of focus. Uh, what do you call the J.J. Abrams lens flare kind of deals almost, but not quite the same thing. It's not what a lens flare is, but might as well be. But it does look pretty magical. Am I right or am I right? It's another day, another Saturday. It's the weekend. We made it here. Look at this thing. You hear that sound? I hear some kind of jangle, jing, jang. Jing, jingle, jing, jing. What is this jingle, jangles? Jingle, jing, what, what the, what the heck? Why is this the sound of approaching things? What's going on? Oh. Hello, friends and neighbors. Welcome to another production of the program. Here we are on TV. Once again, once a day, every day, turn the machines and live forever. Uh, I got moving around or something's going on. Who am I and why? I got a uh, a burger today. I went to Arby's and they got the good burger like from the show. The show, you know, they, oh, yeah, they keep it close to the sticker. Oh man, I want to get one of these stickers. Or maybe when I got the one that's here. Well, I want them to give me an, a, a roll of them. Um, you guys got a roll of these good burger stickers? It says it right on there. Uh, this is Good Burger. Welcome to Good Burger. Home of the Good Burger. Can I take your order? This is home of the, um, um, Arby's. Welcome to Arby's. Home of the Good Burger. I saw the movie and I was, I bought into the, oh, dang. I bought into the, um, the promotional deal that they're selling the burger. Uh, the burger from the meal. Uh, it's gonna be good. It's in the name. It looks thick. And it's from Arby's. Yeah, it's a thick, thick burger. It's got Arby's, or I mean, uh, kind of Mac sauce on it. It's good, but frothy. There's a bacon on it. Or the patty is just up. Uh, I don't know. It's a little undercooked, maybe, but. I that's how it's supposed to be. It's thick. I thumped them. Um, well, I did it. I was driving by there a few weeks ago, and maybe even within the last couple of weeks, one week, when I saw they had the good burger on the window. Oh, I want to get that window in this way. It's going to have my inside of my house look like McDonald's. How do I get that window this way? I'm going to go to Arby's. Tell them, Arby's, what are you going to do with that window display when you're done with it? They might throw it in the garbage. I'm going to go pay off some Arby's guy. Uh, Arby's probably will be happy. The kid at Arby's will be happy because uh, if they're working at Arby's, I, I, I assume... They're desperate for money. I don't know if it's any different than the um the uh the other Arby's burger. I went there. I mean, it was over a year ago. But Arby's like, we're selling burgers now. Like, oh my god! And I went there and I got it. Pretty good though. Mac sauce is good. Mac sauce or secret sauce. 
This is kind of like Thousand Island dressing, but uh, it really does make a burger. And uh, yeah, it is a good burger. It's a good burger. Like, no false advertising. Like, hey, pretty, pretty good, just fine. Uh huh. Well, they're good. That's it. That's my uh, review. My Arby's review. Good. Good burger. Good. Oh, it's a Wagyu burger, apparently. And that was ordered by Masail. It's on here. Um. When Kiara was here, a few. Uh, what, last week? Only last week, um, a few days ago, just Sunday, last Sunday, not even a week ago. Uh, she wanted to see the uh, Sleater Kenny sign. Was that band? Which I don't know if this band's popular, but do they have any big hit songs? Whatever it is, this receipt says Slater Kenny. It's like, I don't know, I don't want to go to this, take a picture of the sign, but what I can do is um, get an Arby's, Arby's receipt from the place. And now I have that, and uh, it's it's there. Uh -huh. um, yesterday I was here on a Friday at mm, <laughs> must have been a similar time. I saw this movie at 6:55. Um, so, must have, excuse me, been here around 5.30, yeah, 5.30 to 6.30, uh, talking to Mr. Gintu for a while, he was there, talking about, um, Mr. Gintu's issues, he was going to the store, buying Red Bull, uh, he didn't get a job at the gas station because there's rumors in his neighborhood that he's a racist. Not good rumors to have about yourself. If you ask me. Um, I would not want to have that rumor. But Mr. Ginsu has the rumor and it, 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 he says it resulted in him not getting a job at the gas station. But I think that there might have been other factors. Um, it might be his gr general gruffness. He's got a scruff McGruff kind of gruffness there. And uh, I think it could be that. That could have played a part at least. Can we at least admit that, Mr. Ginsu? That is just a part of it was the gruffness and not just the whole racism rumors. I mean, even if there's rumors, that's, isn't that enough? I don't want, you don't want to ruin your life over rumors, but like, um, well, I heard you were a racist in the neighborhood, and this is the neighborhood establishment, and if you work here, what does that say about us? And uh, even if you get called a racist, maybe that's it after that. So, it's like, I don't know, you may or may not be a racist, but there's rumors that you are, and sorry. I'm sorry about that. But that might be enough. Um, yeah, Mr. Gintu. Other messages, I think. I don't remember at all. Um, was it yesterday we were talking to James? Or was that two days ago? I think that was two days ago. Thursday, Friday. Today's Friday. Yesterday is Friday. Today's Saturday. Um, after, the, after the program yesterday, I went to see this movie called... Thanksgiving, which is a slasher movie about Thanksgiving, and there was some children in the theater. Their parents took their children to see the movie, which I'm fine with. I was like, hey, look at this. This is a nice family outing to see a uh, nasty slasher. People got stabbed up and stuff. It's a movie. <laughs> And it took place in Massachusetts, Bill. Ah, thank I like Thanksgiving. Yeah. Hey, get out of here. 
I'm parking my car, okay? Hey, what you, what's it up? We're going to Boston, Mass, okay? With my uh, Boston accent. I think it's Plymouth, Massachusetts. It's pretty close to Boston. I'm from Boston, okay? I'm from the city. I got a car. I got a good car, okay? Don't try to go nowhere. Hey, don't go nowhere. I'm driving my car. I'll see you in an hour. An hour. Can't say ours. An hour. I'm going to park my car. My car. My car. Car, 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 car. Can't say ours. Hey, R, I, R, I. You like you hear it differently? Shout dear. Shout. Shout dear. I don't know about um, dialects. Show sure uh, That was yesterday. I saw that movie. Ate a lot of popcorn. A little bit sick. Um, did that whole thing. It was dark outside. It's dark now. It's only not even, um, you know, dark at like by 5 o'clock. And that's, that's good. And then it's like, wow, look, nighttime. And I'm like doing stuff at nighttime. Um, but stuff is open. I like doing stuff at nighttime. I just want to uh, value village and goodwills and stuff. But yes, okay. So I saw a movie, made it home last night. You know, a little bit of TV, a little bit of sleeping, knitting. Um, I'm almost through the brown knitting. I'm going to move on to this big ball. I made a ball that sits on my head. I'm going to move on to that very soon. Um, yeah. And um, so knitting sleeping, TV, uh, not reading. I got to find a new book to read. Um, I went today and went out, tried to go to this thing, uh, you know, went to bed moderately late because it's the weekend. Hey, it's the weekend, right? Am I right? Oh, man. Um, and then I uh, uh, slept in. Woke up late. Excuse me. Slept in. Watching TV again. I ate breakfast. Ate that bacon fried rice for breakfast. Um, and then I was going to go down to Duck the Mall, as it was called. But um, it was not this week. It's next week. They're doing this um, crazy uh, toy run or something. I think it's called the Toy Run. And they are going through town like motors. I don't know what they're doing. It's called Toy Run, but it's just like a bunch of motorcycles driving in the middle of downtown and completely blocking off traffic. So there was like nowhere to go and traffic was way backed up all the way up the hill. You can see it up the hill. And I got caught up in it and it took me like 20, 30 minutes to get out of downtown. And uh, I didn't know it was happening. I don't think a lot of people did either. And we all got stuck in it. And uh, I don't know what they do. It's called Toy Drive. Motorcycles drive around, and then they block the streets. I don't know if they're giving toys to children. What are they doing? What's, what are they giving to uh, the... What are they contributing? Here you go, kids. Here's some toys. In downtown. In the afternoon. Blocking the streets. I don't know what, what, what but... Uh, oh, it was okay. I didn't have anywhere to go, so I was just like, oh, my God sit in my car. I might as well sit in the car, sit anywhere else. I'm going to go sit somewhere and do something with my time. Oh, look at this. Hey, how about a traffic jam? So I sat through a traffic jam. Um, and then I went to this market. It was, the, they called it Bad Girls Market. Um, cause, oh, yeah. So I thought it was going to be Deck the, deck the no, they called it Duck the Malls. It's at the Capitol Theater. They call it Duck the Malls, and it's a, um, they're like, hey, don't go to the mall. Go here and buy your things. So you still want to buy things. Um, but I went to Duck the Mall to buy things, but they were closed, or they weren't even open because it's, um, it's Monday. I thought they were going to be open, but they were not open. It was next week. So I got caught in traffic. But then I realized it was called, there's this thing called Bad Girls Market, which is like another craft fair, lots of craft fairs. You know, people are selling stuff. Who's going to like buying stuff? They're like, hey, you want to buy 
jewels <laughs> or necklace or one person's like drawing on clothing. Like hey, you wanna draw on this clothing like with words? You wanna buy this stuff? And uh, I didn't buy what did I buy? I bought a mystery box and uh, some stickers. Um but Duck the Malls is next week. I guess I'm going to go back there and look at more crafts that I don't necessarily um, want to get. Hey, look at these crafts. Hey, you like crafts? Cra crafts? If you want crafts, then come to the Duck the Malls or whatever it is. I'm going to buy some crafts. People spend their whole year crafting, and then they sell their crafts at the market there. Um, I've been knitting, but I'm knitting one giant thing. So I'm just going to call the blanket and say, this blanket is uh, $500. You want to buy this one thing? I don't have more than one thing, so i got to sell it all. It's got to be worth my day. So you got to buy this whole thing. can't just buy a piece of it. There's a whole uh, craft fair, but I bought a mystery box. I don't know what's in it. I mean, that's the whole point. I like the mysteries. Too many things, you know what they, what it is. I'm gonna go like go to a restaurant, go to stores, whatever it is. And it's like, hey, give me some stuff. And I'm like, oh, here you go. Here's a box of stuff. Like this food, you know. I ordered my burger today, but I would have liked to just gone there and been like, here's ten dollars. And they're like, oh, uh, I'm like, give me some food. Like, what kind of food? Don't surprise me. Surprise me. Here's ten dollars. We don't want to do that. But that's what I want to have. I don't want to choose anymore. Hey, food me up. Hello, what can I get you? You choose. Here's ten dollars. Uh, we're just gonna do like the most standard thing there is. All right. Well, this is the most standard thing there is. I went to Arby's specifically for this movie promotion, though. Well, couch time's almost over. I'll get through this. I'll call my brother, see how he's doing. I think he might be in Tacoma, actually. Well, I'll tell him I got this burger. Okay. Mmm. It's a good burger. It's like medium. It's a good burger. Um, yeah, I went to the Value Villages at night and Goodwill. I was like, hey, oh. look, nighttime. I'm getting myself pilled up here, but uh, yeah. I left the house like right when the sun was going down and I'm, it's like doing stuff at night when it's the, yeah, it's like the day or the night. I almost went over there. I want to get a pecan. Well, not Picanye, not Kanye. My brother's saying, I was saying, I want to go get Picanye steak. You know, it's called Picanye. Picanye, not Kanye West steak. But I never had it before, and I don't know if there's like a colloquial name for it. But I watched that Google guy on YouTube, and he said to eat the Picanye. And I'm going to go to my local butcher. There is a Mexican spot, but I don't know. Picanye sounds Mexican, or Spanish at least, but I. Uh, it's big in Brazil. Maybe they'll have it at the. I should go to the. I should probably go to that Mexican butcher any, anyway instead of the one in Hawks Prairie. I wonder if I can call them. Maybe I should try to call them from here. You guys have picanha? I don't know what it is. I, I actually, yeah, don't really know what it is. I heard it's in the cow's butt. Above the cows or the waist. My brother's saying the cow's waist. Is he saying his waist? Oh, like the cow's waist around their hips above their butt
Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message system. Three, six, zero, four, eight. Uh, where's Andrew? Oh, what the heck is this? The meat wasn't going. Oh, here's an emergency. Oh, it's been blurry, but that's because there's like some car over there. It's not moving. What are you doing, car? <laughs> oh. I don't know what to tell you, but no. Oh, it's so fucking sunny over here. You just wouldn't believe it, motherfuckers. It's like a party waiting to happen. Yep, yep, that's what I was supposed to do. Maybe that's a good thing. Didn't the party. Whoa. Whoa, motherfucker. I am present in the council or whoever. There's a motherfucker out there. And then I won't say that any part of that would be just to grab you. What they can do. Then I'm burnt. Yeah. Don't burn yourself in the paint. So they're not saying that. Oh, what are you fucking. Hey, you know you want to say it. Don't say it. Same time, buddy. Mostly my... I want to take it, but I ain't going to take it. Uh, you know that toilet paper thing you like. You know that toilet paper thing you like. are not going to be running. <laughs> it's just funny how upset everyone gets about this kind of thing um, on a Saturday, but it, I think it's fun and adds to the charm and character of our weird city. Um, and I don't. I think it's cool that they're like sort of tough biker dudes just driving around and making a lot of noise. So anyway, yeah, I thought you should call me back. It hasn't happened yet. 
I'm calling you. I just wanted to remind you. I got caught up in it. Today, um, give me a ring. Uh, we can talk about our experiences. Maybe other viewers and callers out there have had experiences um, with the swear word. Maybe they think I'm wrong. Maybe they think I uh, should be upset. I'm walking the dog, and she's drinking street water. Hey, <laughs> street water. I'm here with Patsy the dog. We're taking our morning walk. Anyway, call me back. Talk to you later. Bye. I think Freddy is going to be working. Hi, Kenny. It's me. Hi. Hello? Posters for um, what? Tool, the band Tool. Uh, we got Frank Ocean, Jimi Hendrix, and The Misfits. That uh, anime movie Akira. Lots of posters. You're putting them in that poster rack? Yeah, we got a poster rack, and then the the college students come in and they buy them, and then they put them on their dorm walls. Probably, I mm. assume. Uh, is you, see the, you see the the um, motorcycles? Yeah, I actually got caught up and I didn't know it was gonna happen. Then I was driving through, or I, I came down here and I went to the. Uh, I thought it was gonna be duck the malls, but then it wasn't. And then I accidentally got caught up in it and I was in traffic for like 20 minutes. Yeah, I meant to tell you. I, uh, afterwards, I thought, wait, I should have told. Can do the show like at two, so you could videotape and then went right outside the studio. Oh, they drive right outside. Did you see that tape I made last year of them driving the motorcycles? Yeah, I don't remember what happened to that tape. Did I ever watch it? I don't think you ever watched it on the air that I know of. So, wow, that we was a whole year it. ago already. Yeah, I could have come in yeah. here and taped it. I forgot about that. Yeah. Anyway. I guess I didn't, not much else happened. Um, I like these things. I wonder what the other people, and some people don't like it, some people like it. Um, well, I think it's fine. I know you were talking about the traffic. I was in the traffic, and I looked, I could see the traffic, and it went all the way up the west side of hill. Oh, yeah. Yep, it's a, it's a big one. They closed the bus, all kinds of stuff. Lots anyway, of traffic. Go. Yep. All right, got to work. Yep. All right. Well, Bye. we got half an hour. Bye. Working, working hard, hardly working. Oh, she keeps on calling John Webster. Yeah, I'm had very good luck with communicating with him recently. Friday, bye future. Yeah. Hey, future, it's us the past. Saturday, did you see the motorcycles go by? Got caught in traffic for a few hours. Ate the good burger. It was good. Uh, you get caught in traffic, you see it all the way up there. Where are you? What time is it? Bye future. Well, let's take a look at this. What's in here now? Super Bowl? Go to win this trophy and to play in the AFC NFC Pro Bowl next Sunday on ABC. I don't know what year this is. I didn't figure it out yet. John Webster knows all the teams from all the Super Bowls in the past. Some people do. But I, I still don't even know what the other team... Oh, the Chargers? Is that... Chargers. 
San Diego Chargers versus the San Francisco 49ers. Yep. Well, it's it's how you start the season. The San Francisco. Are they still there? I wonder if the Super Bowl is the most copyrighted thing there is. I don't know. Uh, but what were the Super Bowl commercials? Offsides. Ding, 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 ding. Football. Fast forward into the final commercials. SF, you ever been to San Francisco before? You've seen San Francisco 49ers? San Francisco, 22. I oh. wonder who we look. Who's this guy? BYU, Bardotes. At an age where, you know, you begin to wonder. Or he's been look pro forward. for 10 years and he's 275 pounds. Uh-huh. Oh, is he, he's a big deal in there. Oh. Go to the big Look at that perfect field position. Best car there is. Now, an oil made just for your hard-working engine. 4x4 from Quaker State. Off-roading, extreme temperatures, towing and hauling. They all make your light truck or 4x4 work extra hard and could shorten its life. Why settle for a conventional car oil? Get 4x4 from Quaker State. No. Good. And independence life. has showed 4x4 superior to leading conventional car oils in protecting it's against the oil. that can shorten engine life. Good morning, guys. Just when you think your diarrhea medicine is working. Oh, boy. What's wrong? It diarrhea. Can let you down. Just when you think your diarrhea is working. But you can count on ammonia oh, AD oh, to stop. Oh, year, right? this year on the on the um so they got cola we got cola here or probably the 90s I think your diarrhea look at this guy working. get diarrhea uh, -uh i got diarrhea it can let you 2012 but you can count on this to stop diarrhea often in just one dose instead of dose after dose more than a third of a bottle of the pink stuff and Imodium AD is even better than the leading prescription I told you we should have stopped for Imodium AD Imodium AD one dose relief you can count on for diarrhea Hey DM Sanders what are you doing tomorrow night Hey Brad Tam would be at the American Music Awards and you know it's all good Hey The American Music Awards hey. tomorrow here on ABC DM Sanders yeah I think DM Sanders did some and then after Rapid. you see Dion tomorrow, you'll see him next Sunday, a week from tonight, 6 o'clock Eastern Time, 3 Pacific. We'll be in Honolulu for the Pro Bowl. And then in two weeks, the State Farm U.S. Figure Skating Championships on ABC's Wide World of Sports. Hmm, what year was that? All right, let's take a look at the last couple of weeks, see what we've been doing. Uh, dropping cereal. I was real on cereal. That was the first one I ate um, at all. Because I bought it, now I gotta go buy some more. Alright, we're gonna go back two weeks. Sure, it's us, the. I, don't know, I kinda wanna look at the entire month of December or November, but that'd be a lot. Because today's already the second. So, about 12 days, so 30, 20, 28, when you were on. 18th. We're gonna go to run Saturday the 18th. I think it's gonna be the 18th. Here it goes. We'll see. We'll see where it goes. Monday, Sunday. Um, that's about a week ago. Here's one week ago on the 25th. And we're gonna keep back going backwards till the 18th. Five, four. Uh, Thursday the 23rd. Wednesday the 22nd. Tuesday the 21st. Monday the 20th, uh, Sunday the 19th, and Saturday the 18th, right? Did I do the math right? I guess we're right about to find out. Monday, 
Sunday the 19th. Oh, I did the math right, right? I think that's what I said. I know, easy math. Thank heaven. Next one, one day. Oh, that was two weeks ago, huh? Thank heaven. All right, bye future. Of the future just the past. It's Saturday. And uh, we're getting political. People give us political signs, spell up and think. We need to do a basque. We're going to steak tacos. Uh, another place. The weekend. Bye, future. Future just the past. Hello. Future. We hear about the Big Lebowski. We hear some stories from some callers. Disturbing stories, uh, mostly. What do you say, Future? I saw a bird die <laughs> from a cat. Do you know what I have to say about hair and bones, Future? What? I'm meeting uh, Fuji. Are they still there? Still the same person? They're flat? Yeah. One of the night guard. Future is just the past. What do you have to say to the future, Robman Chris? Do what? Why did I see my future? What do you have to say to the future? If I if I can just get all I want is to get what makes me happy. Uh, I've lost uh, almost everything right now, but the one thing I truly want is good looking, have long arms of those good looking girls, and look by looking young. I want, to get, I, I want to get songs. I want to have my songs in the mainstream. Future is the past. We're going to say the future today, Chris. The what? The future. The future. Yeah, I hope the future is bright. Yep. <laughs> My future. Napoleon, tell us your message. Isabel, what do you have to say in the future? Oh, hello, Napoleon. What's your message, Napoleon? Um, I hope I marry this guy. Also, shout out that influence podcast on the Guys, the car is blowing up. This is the past. This is a message for everybody doing Thanksgiving. Um, um, again, just keep your eyes open, keep vigilant. Don't let any shit happen, don't let anything get past you. Make sure you keep everybody in check hard. Wear Make costumes. Sure you keep everybody in check. Wear costumes to avoid awkwardness and look out for photographic porn. Wear costumes. A bit, the bigger the better. And if, you, and if you're set of political things, wear a costume that will bring up that political thing. Bye, future. Future! It's just the past. What do you have to say in the future? Emily! Wait, what? What do you have to say in the future? Good luck. Good luck, Future. It's Black Friday and Indigenous People's Day, and they're not doing it. Bye, Future. Hey, Future, it's us, the past. It's Saturday. It's uh, day three of the four days. You got another one next week. Um, ate a steak, sleeping. It's cold outside. Did you catch up? What's it like up there? Did Kiara make it? Bye, Future. Hey, Future, it's just the past. Woo! In the past. Say something in the future. Future! Past. Future! Past. You guys here? From Sacktown? 
from Sac Pal 916 Quickly. 916. Bye. Bye. Future. Bye. Future's us the path. Hey, Future. Did the doctor prescribe you Kratom? Did you give that guy a heart attack? How's the bullets? How's your health? Did uh, can I make it back on the train? It's foggy. Did you live? Bye, Future. The past. It's Tuesday. We got pizza. We're feeling real. We'll make you back into the office. Did you uh, make the day make this garlic, pepperoni, taffy, spinach, pineapple pizza again? What year is it? My future. Pepperoni, spinach, pizza. It's just the past. Hey guys, we want to say we are so excited for the new reboot of The Office, and Zoe is going to be in this reboot. Um, he will be playing the new comedy release, the new clown character, Bozo the Funny Clown, and we're so excited to introduce Bozo into The Office and to introduce Bozo into the reissue of Seinfeld, um, where we will also be replacing Michael Richards. Thank you so much. Mm, Zoe, uh, Michael Richards. Kramer, mm -hmm. are you a teenage person from Sacramento? Hey, future, that's the past. Hey, future, you're coming. Uh, J not. It's James. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, it's me. I should change my name, too. James, your name. No James had to go to the hospital for crotch rot, <laughs> basically. Um, it's uh, another brought, day. Brought, brought. Uh, th Thursday. I got pizza. We saw something on the bus. Bye, future. Bye. It's just the past. The past. Future. Mr. Ginsu, pass out for good. Well, I do. Oh, he passed. What's the pass out well, Friday, bye future. Bye. Future, it's just the past. What's well, today? Saturday, did you see the motorcycles go by? Got caught in traffic for a few hours. Ate the good burger. I saw That's it. Good. Uh, did you get caught in traffic? You see it all the way up there? Where are you? What time is it? Bye future. Wow. All right. Well, should we try to call John Webster? Let's do it. Last time he was like pretty much actually sleeping. It's been a few days. I'm not calling him every single day. Uh, <laughs> a lot of days though. It's a lot of days. It's a lot of days. Clearfield. Hello, this is Kenny from TV. Is uh, John Webster available? Yeah, who is this? Kenny, right? Yeah. Yeah, hold on. Give me one second. Thank you. Hey, John. This is Kenny on the phone. Go ahead, Kitty. Hey, John. You there? I wonder if John, is Johnny was asleep. Are you watching your shows? Yeah, he's watching um, SWAT. Oh, yeah, he's very invested in SWAT. He doesn't usually want to talk to me when he's watching SWAT. John, you want to watch SWAT and not talk to me? <laughs> you want to say hi? Sounds like it. Can you hear me? Uh, <laughs> he really likes SWAT, and I think it's on right around now. I even yeah. I, oh, I still haven't even seen SWAT. I gotta try to watch it. Um, well, is it on speakerphone? Is that his? Does he have his hearing aids? 
No, but he, he can hear it, though. <laughs> John, you, are you ignoring me? <laughs> um, well, it sounds like he doesn't want to talk. It's okay. John, call right. me sometime, okay? Call him sometime, John. All right. All right, bye. Oh, take it easy. Pesticides. All right, bye, future. Hey, future, it's just the past. Hello. Hello. I'm here in person this time, and I'm waving at you. Goodbye. It's uh, Thanksgiving. Uh, drink water. Be nice to each other. They were. Everyone was nice to each other. It was nice. I got Thanksgiving food. Andrew's here. Happy thanks. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Sophia. Thanksgiving. Bye, future. Goodbye. Thanks for taking. Hey, future. It's us in the past. Oh, hi, it's past. It's Friday. We we're talking to Grandma. She's watering the plants. It's the afternoon. Uh, Mark is watching the Seahawks versus the Cougars football. And uh, it's Black Friday. Mm. I won it yesterday. People were nice. I found my tooth. Putting holes and super glue packaging. Um, it's today. It's today we're alive. Okay, bye, future. <laughs> today we're alive. Hey, future, it's just a pass. Hey, future, can you do a backflip? Uh, yep. Tomorrow we might go to the parade, but I'm not sure. Andrew says it's boring. What parade? Uh, Chucky puked at it, though. Okay, bye, future. Hey, future test the past. Today, we, hey, we're all here. The whole right. gang. Paul's alive. We are looking at. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Show's uh -oh, over. Uh -oh, we saw a, some oh, no. footage. Oh no. Okay. Well, we're looking at some of this stuff. It's going to be stretched out a little bit. Oh, it's. Oh. Because I, I changed the settings, but uh. It's all right. This is like the Christmas parade stuff. These are elf Christmas clothes. Christmas parade oh. stuff. Oh yeah. Uh, underwear. Oh. <laughs> All right, that was not a good. <laughs> it's Sunday and Paul's on the phone. He's alive, I guess. I'm not gonna call him again to see if he's alive. Uh, Give me the county coming up. Bye, future. Check it out. Bye, future. Hey, future. It's us, the past. It was Dan Dobler's birthday today. Oh. Hey, uh, this is Dan. Sorry, I couldn't make it to the show, but I'm tired. I've had a long day. <laughs> I, I had a birthday. Oh, Dan Dobler's and, birthday. And, and I, I, I wish everybody a, a, a happy new year. Good. All right, thanks, thanks Dan. Dan. Nice. It's uh, Monday, and Luke's here, and Freddie's here. We're talking about the Cleveland County Awards. Mm, Dan Mark. Dobler's dead Do now. Messages. We can get kind of uh, philosophical for a minute about advice and stuff. Oh, and also uh, time scale. Yeah. And we, and we all <laughs> made it Mr. Ed horse noises. And... That's the best part of the show, actually. So I advise you to uh, keep watching yeah, the same episode, home. and we'll keep making horse noises. And oh my be, God! We'll be <laughs> horse noises will be better than horse sex. Horse noises. Oh, my future. Bye. Horse noises. Oh, horse noises. That was 2019. Here's last year. I'm still inside. Hey, hey in, uh, are you still there? I'm fucking fail. Hey, what year is it? No, uh, it's I don't know. I'll okay, get back to you too. Bye bye. Oh, and uh, looking, maybe we're actually in the future and you're in the past. Time is a figment of your imagination. And until the circle of life connects us again, I love you as always. Halo. Oh, Halo. Thanks. 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 All the way down, it's uh, Tuesday. I'm gonna go back to the studio tomorrow and get some pizza. That's right. Yeah, he's getting out of quarantine. I finally figured out, I finally got it all worked out, but now it's time to uh, step back, step back into the producer role. I got all the machines figured out again. Um, good times. In the studio, excited to have you back in the studio tomorrow, Kenny. Thanks, got, future, bro, bye. I, think I got, uh, iced in the next day when I was gonna leave. Day. No, 
I'm not sick anymore. Just ice. Yeah, I'll plan on leaving. But it's no hit. So. All right. Plan on leaving, but I got iced in. I uh, got locked out of my car. I left oh, my keys at work and then got them back in the time of the program. What did you say, Alpha? Alpha. Not saying anything. I'm back at the studio. Hello, fellas. Are you? I got Woo! back. Bye, future. It's winter. Yeah, when am I going to get iced in? Is it winter yet? I don't think it is. It's us, the past. It's Friday. How's it going to be back at the studio? Did you live? Did you get reinfected? Did you find all the batteries? I think I did. Mr. Ginsu left some messages. Still pizza. How long is it going to take before I'm over pizza? I'll go back to a grocery store. Live in. I'm going to look at these messages now, too. Okay, bye, future. Yeah, pizza and grocery store. This is the life. This is the life. Um, well, let's see. We got about eight minutes left. John Webster wasn't there. Should we try to call Yellow Fellow? Out there in Philly? I think it's this one. Hey, big guy. Hey, fella. How was your Thanksgiving? Good turkey? Uh, how's the show going? Hey, good. Drive turkey. I'm going to try to leave you some more voicemails again. I'm going to try to be a more active participant. Um, call me whenever, you know, you're doing the show. And, uh, I'll try to do my part as well. Yeah, what's up? sometimes you might catch me when I'm getting off work. My schedule is very busy. Hopefully things calm down again. Please We're leave your message for stuff. two, two, three, two, four, zero, four. Um, I'm still sober, and uh, and I think I'm getting all easier. And uh, I don't get to talk to people. There's a lot of people I need to reach out to. A lot of old friends who haven't heard from me in a while. And I don't even know if a lot of these people want to hear from me again. Maybe, maybe some do, maybe some don't, maybe somebody, maybe some of them will be upset with me for going off the radar for so long. I don't know. MGMT is releasing new music, so I can't be too, uh, can't be too upset with the world right now. Uh, you know, bubblegum, bubblegum dog. Bubblegum dog is out. Bubblegum dog? Bubblegum dog. 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 Bubblegum dog? Bubblegum dog? Bubblegum dog? Bubblegum dog? Uh, I already called Freddy once. I don't know if you call him again. Tell him it was Dan Dobler's birthday. Um, I mean... He's dead. I kind of want to go visit his grave. The grave of Dan Dobler. It's out there in Yelm. Um, I kind of also want to go visit the grave of uh, John Horseman. And uh, I guess that's it. Just John Horseman and um, Dan Dobler. My grandmother has a grave somewhere as well. We go hit up all the graves around here. Those are the only ones that I know of uh, who are in these local spots. Yeah, John Horseman's out there in Lacey. I don't know if there's any cemeteries on the west side. There's a weird cemetery across the street from Walmart and Tumwater, which is south. Is the west side southwest? Because like, you're going up there, you got to go like you, on the way to Tumwater, then you can go to the west side. I wonder if it is southwest. Tomorrow is just regular south and west side southwest. I don't quite know how it works. But uh, I know it seems like it's more south, though. The west side is slightly south, even though they call it the west side. And it is west, but the east side. And then there's Tumwater, though. But there's this, like, graveyard that's across the street from Tumwater. But it does not look like it's kept up. 
And I don't know if anybody ever sees it, except for those who are at the bus. And there's a graveyard right across the street, like right behind, right behind you. Um, but uh, yeah, go visit some graves, go get some pictures. There's some video footage of graves. Like, oh, look at this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And move around the grave and stuff because you get some pictures of it instead of just having it be a photo. Because, I mean, what a graves don't have a lot of dynamics. Um, we're going to see this grave, though. But uh, we're getting down to it. Your recording has reached the maximum length. Oh, well, I forgot to about replay you. your message, press 1. To delete and re record your message, press 3. For delivery options, press 4. To cancel this message, press star. To send this message now, Press oh, pound or options. hang up. To mark urgent, press 1. To mark confidential, press 2. To mark urgent and confidential, press 3. To mark normal, press 4. To go back to the pre message marked urgent and confidential. To replay your message, press 1. To delete and re-record your... Um, over. And, uh... And I think I'm coming all easier. And uh, I don't get to talk to people. A lot of people I need to reach out to a lot of old friends who haven't heard from me. Yo, Fo! Oh, remember when I got here earlier today? When I sat down? And uh, I was thinking about the last 24 hours or so. Thinking about yesterday, Mr. Ginsu. Seeing that Thanksgiving slasher movie. Yeah, I saw some kids. I don't know if they left. When I walked in there, I saw that there was like a family with children. And I was like, that's good of you. But then when I was leaving, I didn't see them. So I don't know if they were actually still there. Maybe they didn't sit there the whole thing. It was pretty nasty. And, um, I mean, it was a slasher. I didn't see if those people left though, but I, I did watch the movie, uh, did the whole 24 hours thing. I'm about to go see another movie. Yesterday I ate popcorn, it made me kind of ill, but I'm going to go back and do it again. I'm just going to just keep bashing my guts until I'm sick. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go bash my guts again right now, or pretty soon here, and uh, that was a good time though. I remember I was talking about all that stuff that I've been doing the last day and got stuck in that traffic for like 20 minutes and stuff. Um, we tried to call, oh, hello? Somebody knocking on the door? Tried to call, um, Andrew. Tried to call others. Somebody's like knocking. Maybe not. I thought I heard knocking, now I'm out in the hallway. That was not real. I don't think there was knocking. I heard, I thought I was hearing knocking. Andrew didn't answer, John Webster didn't talk. Um, we looked at that commercial, the commercial, the commercial from like the, um, whenever that time was. Remember? I didn't figure it out yet, but I did figure out that it was the Chargers. It's like, hey, what year did the Chargers and the 49ers face off? San Diego Padres is baseball. I don't know if the Chargers are still there. I don't even know. Um, but we looked at those commercials, looked at the messages from the past. I guess it's been a few days since we did that. We must have had a busy few days. I don't remember. I mean, that was like four or five days. We must have been, oh. busy week, but here it is. We made it. Here's the credit. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Saturday. We're on TCTV, channel 22 to 1130 and 2 a.m. Check it out, yeah. Wait till I'm on YouTube. 360-836-34. Call and leave a message. Get on TV, yeah. Wait till I'm dot com. Ah! Little Dowager, it's a good song. Thank you, TCTV. Little Baby, Jordy Fabo, Social Brooks, Four Star Video, South Spy, Com. Rebecca, Mountain Board, Northwest. University County, Washington State, USA, thank you, and Chris. See you, you're watching, thank you. Hey, John, where are you? Call me. Hell yeah, dog. Bye.